guys, guys. I am fighting temptation as we speak. And the temptation is not conventional. It is, it is Warframe. I'm addicted. There's two items that I really, really want in the Warframe. It's the Operator skin set and it's the the Warframe armor, armor bundle. The, the one with the Wolf of Saturn 6 one. That looks clean in my opinion. Both of them, they look clean. And then they require like the free battle pass for you to do. But it, like everything in Warframe is free. But it isn't free in the sense that it takes your time. And time is still a resource that can be expendable. I've got tissue right here. Empty. Pause. It's full. Guys, I used to blow my nose. Pause. Um, I'm addicted to Warframe. Like this is one of the, like, temptation is always near for me. And it, it, if it isn't replaced by one thing, it's replaced by another thing, you know. And Warframe is one of those things in which, like, I really like the game and everything. It's one of the best MMORPGs that's free of all time out there. It's one of the best free MMORPGs up there with RuneScape. Sorry. Little detour. Blood? Maybe I'm blowing my nose a bit too hard, but then, if I don't, like, how am I getting the bogeys out? I'm not sure. With Warframe, like I, th I feel as if my mind is like slipping into the Warframe. Like I, my dreams, I can't escape from Warframe even in my dreams, bro. Like within my illusions, within my mind, I cannot escape Warframe. It's that bad. And I think to myself, like, if Warframe even that worthy of a game, like for example, let's say I grind really hard. I always I do all the Nora Knight um, challenges for the the free battle pass. I get all the battle pass and stuff and. You know, I completed it, and I got I got the operator skin now. Oh, yippee! And then I got it. And I'm like, no, then what? Then what? Like, what the fuck is the point? There's always gonna be something else to grind. Then I got my prime, my prime mod. I need to grind. I, I need literally six hundred thousand endo to get all my prime mods, my galvanized mods. It's more. Than, I think six hundred and fifty thousand, six hundred and or maybe close to seven hundred thousand endo right now because I got more galvanized mods recently and more ribbons. So, which means I literally need like eight thousand. Endo a ribbon and then like a galvanized mod. I need like 30,000 endo a galvanized mod. Well, not only the credits, we're not even talking about the credits, probably like 200 million credits so easily. I think no, I calculated before, it's like 100 million credits. Um, my prime mods up to date, and I'm gonna have all the prime mods. Like, what the fuck, dude? And then after I get all the prime mods up to date, then I'm gonna be like focusing on builds and that type of stuff. And then after that, I'll probably be focusing on trading because then I need more, I need more platinum for slots. To get more stuff, so I can get more mastery, and that'll be mastery rank grinding. And oh my god, bro, it is not worth it. I love Warframe to death, but it is not worth it, bro. Like, obviously, like I want to spend all my days playing video games, but that's my want. I gotta measure my want, as in, what do I want more? Do I want to spend all my day gaming, or do I want to spend all my day working hard on something that I love that will get me results, that will actually get me somewhere in life? I'm, I'm, I'm at a standstill, guys. Fuck, man. Uh, fuck, man. And I haven't played Warframe since. I played Warframe literally. I didn't even play it. I literally logged. I, I put all my cables in. Cause I, I tucked all my HDMI cables away. My power cable away. My monitor power cable. My PS4 power cable. My HDMI cable. I tuck it all away. My monitor's there, but it's there for show. It's not actually there until I think I, until I really need it for like for like video editing and stuff. So I got a big monitor for video editing. If not, then. Usually I just do everything on my small laptop screen right here. Like everything's off. My computer <laughs> power thing's off. I, mean, I can't even turn on my computer if I wanted to. This is not plugged in. This is not plugged in. It's not plugged in. It's all for show. It's all for show. It looks good in the setup. I like my setup at the moment. It's a bit, it's a bit cramped. I think it might take some time to read actually. It's on my routine. And, you know. I feel as if Warframe has consumed so much hours of my life so far. It's easily consumed like 3,000 hours of my life in total across every platform. That's Nintendo Switch, that's PC, that's I have multiple. I had another account on PC before that, I kind of forgot the password to. I probably can refine the password. Um, I saw it, I found it again recently actually, you know, I did I did find it again. It was like Master Run 3 or some shit, but I spent like probably 100 hours on that, odd hours. And then I got my. I got my I got my Mastery Rank 18 PC account and my Mastery Rank 17 PS4 account. 500 hours, 550 hours on PS4, easily 2,000, 3,000 hours on PC. 
It's just, it's robbed me of so much of my time. And that isn't a flex, by the way. That's fucking loserism. I think it's kind of like, it's kind of a sad thing. Like, all those hours I spent on video games, had I spent on something else, I would have actually achieved something. And like, I, I give myself a moment just to think about it. You know, and it's quite um, disheartening to think about it because... I don't know, I feel like I this individual that we're after. The work is complete. I'm addicted, guys. I'm addicted. Like so many times, when I before I uninstalled Steam, so many times I was fighting the urge to just keep Steam and like re-download Warframe and just go back to the good old days when I'm fucking playing video games all the time, Warframe all the time. And I just have to remind myself, like, yeah, that's not the person I am anymore. I'm not a gamer anymore. And it is simultaneously like it's hard thing because like I'm becoming an adult. I would, if anything, I would like to have adult responsibilities and I would like to. Take control of my life more. I think being in a position where you can't really do anything in your life and you're just trapped by your own, how do I say this, by your own vices is quite a sad way of living. It's quite of a slave like way of living. And for the longest time, especially during COVID, I was living that way as well with Warframe, especially Warframe and with other pay platforms, like Apex, etc. etc. Et I don't know, like, it's like, it's like this classic dilemma of the guys who get a PC and they end up not really playing that much of the PC, but then they kind of have like that fear of, hey, I didn't spend enough time on my PC, etc., etc., and I spent so much money on it, etc., etc., etc. And this is where I would go and say like, try to explore different hobbies that actually feel like they benefit you in some way, because having gaming as a hobby is quite destructive. This is why, like, you, you might be like, oh, well, Jimmy, you play video games sometimes. No, I literally logged on for like 10 minutes in order to try to get a Warframe market sale. And the motherfucker, two of them, two of my clients on Warframe market, they're gonna give me, they're gonna pay me 40 platinum each. Both, I was gonna, I would be 80 platinum richer. And both of them flaked on me. And now I'm broke. So. Oh, woo! <clears throat> One of my voices. Go ahead, be right back. My spooky water. Spooky water. Spooking water. Spooking, spooking, spooking water. There's no spooking water. I was looking at my thing, my SD card in my phone. So I think I'd much rather just put it in my laptop and then work from there. And tissue. Okay, this is going to the bathroom. It's not here. Where am I? Let me get some tissues though. For my nose, to blow 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 my nose. What about that today? I think I'm reaching a weird like, point in my life where, you know, I'm turning 18 very, very soon, 40 days exactly. And I would like to use this time in which I'm turning 18 to really like try to enjoy life a little and try to leverage the time I have in order to try to work really, really hard. It's also something really, really worth it. I have things coming up. I'm coming fight, coming spars, tomorrow I'm sparring. A lot of things coming up and there's a lot, there's a lot to think about, a lot to digest and I think video games, especially Warframe, despite it being such a good game, that kind of like reduces my morbid to play because it's so good and there's so much stuff to do. Like and then and then like for example after like another thousand hours, two thousand hours I reach end game and I've got like a, a bunch of ribbons and all the good weapons and etc etc in con and burst and etc etc and then I think to myself like what really is the point you know 
what is mm, what is the point in, in general? Like, I just feel like I'm wasting my time. I was really close to getting caught and bust and everything, but I don't know. I just don't care about it enough. Um, I don't have like I'm kind of just burned out by it. I don't really have the motivation to play. Same with Apex, the spy. Like, I would be like, solar price, solar price, solar price. Like, all the time invested. I literally don't want to go back at all. Like, I wanted to have that constant reminder. Like, when you play video games without streaming or anything like that, you kind of just don't notice the time is going by. Because I spent oh, well over a thousand something hours. I think it was a thousand five hundred hours on Apex. Which wasn't that much. I thought it was going to be more. When you spend that much time on video games and you don't really stream or anything, you can't really see how much time you spent. And like, you, I kind of feel like I, I get this bit of guilt that comes to that. I'm really glad that I could give myself time to stream like I did before and just just see like how I, I was doing and see how much time I was putting really putting in. And I'm, I, just, I, don't, I would just much rather do something else, you know? The thing with gaming content is on YouTube, like there's no real ceiling for gaming content. I feel like it, for content in general, like it's for me, it's difficult for me to even constitute all the content I can make because my mind is full of so many ideas. The problem is always for me is always going to be execution, which is why I really like this Chun Uncut channel because all I need to do is like it's really simple. I sit down, I talk, done. But for anything else, it feels almost as if like it's it's just it's too much because there's so much process that goes into it. But it's not, not necessarily so much process; it's just a lot of like tedious bullshit work, in my opinion. Like for my channel card channel, I'm already sitting on like 25. I don't know, like check on. It's not on this SD card. It's on my laptop. My phlegm, ew. I'll swallow it. I don't care. Check it out with some sparkling water. Kids having fun. Lol, not me. That could not be me. Okay, how many clips am I sitting on? Sui. When I was 19 years old, I got my first girlfriend, and I felt deeply in love with her. Like we spoke. 19, bro. I got two years. I just want if I, bro, two years, 19, and I could like make 10k a month, for example, bro, I would be set. So, okay, sorry. I just keep thinking about that two year thing because everyone says like, you work on your own yourself for two years and you become and you can get like 10,000. You'll be fine. You get 10,000 dollars a month. I'm thinking about that, like, bro, that would be, that would be nice. That would be nice. I can't lie. Like, I use they and them as my point. What the? Gandalf! Between the legs, and gender is between the ears. Right, it's not. It, wait, was it biological man or woman? I can't tell. Whoa. This is this is terrifying. Dude, I'm scared, mommy. Mommy, I'm scared. Mommy, sorry. Mommy, sorry. I'm on 21 clips, not 25, so I was close. Oh, my channel cut channel and then that was one video and I'm probably gonna go my videos now and see like which is worth thing but like, any of the depressing ones I'll just delete quit manga temptation sleepless night achievement trauma delusion stain urges okay urges I'll delete returning back to England turn old I want to see the progress I want to see best manga ever Okay, I would like to do this for the love of real life. I don't know. Israel Adesanya. Hope is dangerous thing. Hope is turn around insane. Sleeping on a mattress. Favorite chop email. I gotta delete more. Because I gotta lessen my workload. Sleepless night achievements. Yeah, sleepless night I want success. I just wanna make my mom proud. Yeah, it's gotta go. Ugh. I quit manual. I'm gonna be update on that one. I need to make an update on that video. So yeah, I just shaved down my videos 
from how many I was 10 here and my second bin it was 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 so I had like 19 videos in total now I have 10 videos I'm gonna work on so that's shame because I'm like bit my workload like I'm just trying to work on the videos I feel like should I, I really should work on and it will make me satisfied and fulfilled okay I didn't like to do anime too much because I look like a bum. I don't think I said anything significant. Okay, I. I'm going to show you. These are the two things I really want Saturn 6 armor bundle. That looks sexy, can't lie. The Sitting to Battle armor of the. Uh, uh, no, I'm not going to say it. It looks so nice. Drifter Keeler Suit Collection. That was nice. Is there anything else I would I would like to get? Bro, the thing is with Warframe, yeah, I only care about cosmetics. Like I do care about getting stronger, but that's like functional, so I can like play the game more. In more than the end game. But I I only really care about cosmetics. What's that way of saying? Uh credits, Oricon Booster. I already have the MSR Operator Collection. Gamma color set or whatever, I already have a bunch of color sets. Forma, whatever. Claw skin. Claw weapons, what the fuck? That's a weird looking skin. Okay, Fract Shoulder Guard, I did want this, can't lie. That's for sure. Warframe slot, obviously want that. Who doesn't? Most fellas better. Dark Rain Trickery. Mm. For my gains, for Ephemera, G Musky Kids, Umbra, Forma. Yeah, nothing too big. Like, that's the only things I want. Okay, complete three mod transmutations. Kill 150 enemies. Extra damage, six perfect animal captain or Valis. Complete three Kuva Siphon missions. Kill three Thai Eximus. Complete three rescue missions. I thought like I might log in for a bit. I'm not sure entirely. Finish a capture mission in 69 less than 9 seconds. That's what I did already. Kill shot 1,105 1, enemies. Goddamn. Yeah. Everything oh, is new again. I don't know. Like, do I even log on and do my challenges? Like, is it really, really worth it? I'll probably buy, like, Orkin. Catalyst type stuff for it. That's it. I'm still. I'm like one rank away from rank five in new law. New loca. So then there's so much work to do in that game. Like it honestly, like I'm. I'm feeling a bit of passion for it. So I'm. I'm uh, I should. I try to reset my brain with meditation a bit. So I don't feel as much passion for it. But like I get into the game and then without clear solid goals with the game, I almost feel as if it's really tiresome and bothersome. And it doesn't feel like it's rewarding enough. Like if I was purely doing the ranked grind, the no, rank yeah not ranked grind, that's apex. The um the the, the primed the prime set grind. But I think I'd be sad after all because like maybe I'd have like three sets to show for it after like six hours of grinding. So like that that isn't like worth it for me in a sense. So. I'm I'm like I'm happy that I'm just not into the game as much anymore. But I definitely like I worry for the time where yeah, I definitely I'll make the truth like I probably might get back into the Warframe grind because that's the way I am. It's just the way I am in general. But for now I think I'm gonna hit a meditation session and for now I'm gonna catch you guys in the next video. I got a remote now. So I can just click the remote and then the camera will stop recording instead of me just clicking the button and then it just stop recording. Bye-bye, guys. Boom! What the?